I just want to show you how you can quickly create an opening in a wall without cutting the wall entirely open. So on the architecture, I'll click on wall, wall architecture, I'll select the wall type, um, set the height and then uh, sketch out the wall. So once I've done that, I'll go to an elevation of the wall where the wall exists, like this is the south elevation. Click on components, click on model in place, casework. Um, you can give it the name wall opening. Under create, we'll click on solid forms, void extrusion. Select pick a plane. Make sure it's checked. Click on OK. You go to the edge of the wall you want to pick. Make sure that it's highlighted at least in two different planes or three. Select the wall and then go ahead to create a void opening you want. So for this tutorial, I'm just going to create um, a series of opening like this. Because you don't want the extrusion to cut all through the wall, you can set the depth of the extrusion. Because this is a 300mm wall, I'll set it at 150mm. And then I'll click OK. Go to your 3D view by clicking on this icon here. Under Modify, select Cut. Select the void extrusion and select the wall. And it will create the opening for you. This is what we've created. And this is how you can easily create recesses in the wall without having to use different wall types. And uh, you can click on Finish here. If you go to a 3D view, you can see what I have created uh, has this different process. You can use apply material by face to also apply different materials. And if you go to the ground floor, you can see the consistency in the walls and uh, it will save you a lot of um, joinery issues. So thank you and uh, have a nice day.